hi guys how are you guys doing i hope you're all well in this video i wanted to share with you guys what it's like to grocery shop in an actual grocery store in ghana and the costs that come with it if you want to go to these grocery stores it makes sense because it's very convenient and depending on where you live uh, they might be more accessible than your local market area so it's just easier to go there you know what I mean so I just wanted to show show you guys the prices of the things over there I'll do a little bit of a shop and you know we'll round it up and see how much we spent um, so yeah guys the shop I'm going to is called shop right it's in most of the malls in um, Ghana so yeah um, I hope you guys find this video helpful if you do don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe by clicking that red button turn on your notification bell so you don't miss another upload from me and yeah if you're new to my channel welcome my name is Jasmine I've recently moved from Sydney Australia to Ghana and I'm sharing all my experiences here on the channel in the hopes to educate you and inspire you as well so yeah if you have any questions make sure you leave it in the comment section below just a quick one before we get into the video I do have a website where I sell natural skincare and hair care it's www.lashyourskinandhair.com the link will be in the description box if you want to support me you can subscribe to my mailing list just down the bottom of the home page or you can shop on my website I have tons of natural skincare and hair care handmade right here in Ghana let's get into the video right guys i feel like these places are good for imported stuff that you can't find in the local markets generally everything is a little bit more pricier here especially when it comes to the local stuff but you can find everything from milo to bacon to fruits like imported fruits those lemons are not grown in ghana not that i know of anyway they're definitely imported even the limes these are the giant sized ones so they're definitely imported because the limes in ghana the local ones are really little very strong but little um the pineapples here i think they're imported but i'm not too sure but for 2.99 ghana cities for one if you went to the market you get about three of the same pineapples for five ghana cities so as you can see there is a little bit of a difference in prices but for convenience sake you can shop here if you want they do have a wide variety of imported stuff frozen potato chips they have milks they have all different kinds of milk they have full cream milk they have lactose free ones like soy milk i didn't see almond milk but they probably do i'm not too sure um, if you want the powdered milks and stuff they have that they have all kinds of sausages they have different kinds of cheeses available and then um, they have different kinds of margarine and butters available as well this place is great if you want to buy stuff that's imported but if you want to buy local stuff once again i think you're better off just going into the market the eggs here is 20 cds for 20 eggs if you went to the market you get 30 eggs for 20 cds so 10 eggs difference which is quite significant so i think for convenience sake you can come here but i think generally speaking you're better off going into the market okay so yeah guys this is what it looks like it's very comfortable there's usually workers all around that can assist you if you need help 
i always have to be sneaky about my filming guys because these people for some reason i don't know they don't want free marketing so they won't let me film if they see me film this is my favorite chocolate guys this is the 200 grams one and it goes for 59 ghana cds i'm not i think that's quite expensive but i'm not too sure about the conversion and what it's what the price is in the u.s they have a wide variety of spices this is the spice aisle i was just trying to show you this fish spice which is going for 29 cities that's quite expensive the rosemary um packet as well was i think it was 12.99 or 13.99 you can get the same amount for about maybe 10 cities or even eight cities in the market they have a wide variety of salad dressings as well from salad cream to mayonnaise to apple cider vinegar to balsamic vinegar um these were decently priced the apple cider vinegar for the small size was about 13 cds they had rice vinegar as well of course there was a lolly's aisle with chocolates and stuff and that's where all the toys were for people that have kids i guess so yeah you can basically find everything here they have meats they have fish they have stuff like that but i couldn't film every part because i didn't want to be told not to buy this rice i usually get for 49 ghana cds for the five kilo bag but as you can see here it was 53 cds so the difference is not that significant but it will add up over Hi time guys we have had a successful shopping trip I didn't need any of these things but i wanted to show you guys the prices of things so i went shopping anyway so everything that i bought i'm basically going to be giving to my grandma and my cousin and aisha's got her ice cream here so she's a happy person she's not even talking or saying hello to you guys anyway we've got two bags of stuff one here and then one there we'll show you everything once we are home okay So I made it home. Unfortunately, it's loud. I'm in my grandma's house, so that's exactly what happens around here. I just wanted to show you everything that I bought. I bought cornflakes. I got cornflakes. This is bridging cornflakes. I was trying to find Kellogg's because that's the popular one, but I couldn't find it. The cornflakes was 26 Ghana cities and 99 Pesswares for the 375 gram container. I bought these crackers, they're like cream crackers. So like a savory cracker. They were, I bought two for five Ghana CDs and 69 pesos. I bought Band-Aid for uh, 14 CDs and 99 pesos. I got ice cream as well. I'm gonna show you. It's actually quite nice. I think it was nine CDs for this ice cream. It's called Prestige Ice Cream. This is the vanilla flavor. Go give it to grandma. I think she's awake. I also bought Heinz Salad Cream. That was, I bought two of these and that went for 12.99 for one. I bought baked beans, five CD and 49 pesos. And then I bought Milo. The Milo was the 400 grams one, and that went for 15 CDs and 49 pesos. In total, I spent 132 Ghana CDs and 79 pesos. I'll convert it all into dollars for you guys. If you guys find this video helpful, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already by clicking that red button. Don't forget to follow your bliss. So now life is short. Follow your bliss. Na nipayete. Follow your bliss. Na diebesi biya ye. And follow your bliss. Na dene mata. Take care, guys. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you find it helpful and you want to see more of it. I'll see you in my next one. Take care, guys. And subscribe. Bye. <laughs> subscribe, she says. Subscribe. <laughs>